without music for a science experiment today. If I put this yellow tablet in the jar of water, what do you think will happen? Let's see if you're right. Look, it's turning the water yellow. Here's a blue one. If I put this blue tablet in the yellow water, what do you think will happen? Let's see. Wow, the water is now green. Yellow and blue make green. Isn't that amazing? Who? Who? It's Ollie. Hello, Hayden. Who? Who? Does that colored water belong to you? Yes, Ollie. I use these bath tablets to change the water from yellow to green. It's amazing. Yellow and blue make green. It's true. I've got a story about water just for you. Listen up. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Follow me through who? I've got a Bible story for me and you. Hello, friends. I'm Justin the Mailman. It's so good to see you. I've got all sorts of letters to deliver today. Oh, wow. Look at this one. It's a wedding invitation, see? You're invited. Someone gets to go to a party celebrating two people getting married. Which reminds me of our story for today. Do you want to hear it? Great. Let me just put the story mail in the mailbox. Today's true story from the Bible is about someone amazing. But first, let's practice our that's amazing face. So on the count of three, I want you to pretend you just saw something truly incredible, wonderful, amazing. Ready? One, two, three. That's amazing. Yes, you did it. Okay, remember that face because I want to tell you about someone who did something amazing and made a lot of people make their that's amazing face. The story begins with a wedding. It was quite the party. Look, there's the bride and groom. They just got married. On the count of three, let's all say congratulations. Ready? One, two, three. Congratulations! Well, guess who was invited to this wedding? Jesus, his mom Mary, and the disciples. They were all there to celebrate and have a good time. The party had special food. Wow, look at that. And they were drinking super fancy party drinks. But the family that was having the wedding party ran out of the special drink. This was a big problem. And Mary wanted to help. She knew that Jesus is amazing and could do amazing things. So she asked Jesus for his help. She told the helpers to do whatever Jesus told them to do. Jesus asked them to get six big jars. Let's make sure we have six. Are you ready to count? One, two, three, four, five. Whoops. We need one more jar. And six. There we go. Then Jesus said, fill them up with water. Water? 
but the wedding needs super fancy party drinks. Hmm. I wonder if Jesus is about to do something amazing. Let's watch and find out. So the helpers filled six jars up with water. Can you pretend to be a helper and fill a jar with me? Get your pretend water pitcher and pour it out. They're almost full and done. Great job, helpers. Then Jesus said to take some of the drink out of the jar. Look, the water became super fancy party drink. He did it. Jesus is amazing. And everyone who saw what Jesus did was amazed. Can you make your that's amazing face? Ready? One, two, three. Yes! That's how everyone felt because they saw Jesus do something amazing. Oh, hey there, Ollie. Tell me, who is amazing? Jesus is amazing. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who is amazing? Jesus is amazing. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. I'll see you next time. So there's your story, and it's all true. Everyone was amazed at what Jesus could do. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Who? Who? Wow, Jesus can do the most amazing things. Jesus is amazing. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say got it. Get it? Got it! Good! I wonder what will happen if I mix red with yellow. See you next time! <laughs>